yep, did a good job. Had a good run. A little too patient, maybe, but that's okay. We finished, you know, and the kid, Austin, did a great job, great car. I don't know, he's 15, 16 years old. Give him credit. You know, he outraced the old guy today. A yeah. couple yeah. of tires would have helped me, but that's okay. Had a good run. Yeah, no, and uh, you've been around racing a long time. You've seen some upcomers. You've seen some goers. What do you think of this kid and his future? I mean, does he have a bright future? And I'm not talking NASC. Everybody thinks they're the next. But, All I mean, right. you've raced. I mean, can this kid go on and compete at the actual level and, and be a winner at that level? Oh, I think so. I th he seems to be a listener. Uh, just by him winning today, he's listened to somebody that's told him, don't abuse your equipment, You'd be around at the end, and that's what makes you a racer. Um, wrecking on lap three of a 150-lap race, I won't say what that makes you, but, you know, you got to be there at the end. And then the kid's done a great job. Uh, NASCAR is a dollar figure. Uh, everybody thinks you're going to NASCAR. Well, NASCAR, I hope, keeps going. They're struggling just like everybody else in the world is. But um, uh, his opportunities there, uh, pays attention. Don't go too far, too quick. Um, and listen, you know, advice, just take all the advice you can take. And don't lose your cool on the track. We've now caught up with the winner of this Spud 150, and that's 16-year-old Austin Terrio in his first late model race. Put this in perspective, at such a young age, what this means to your career is what you've done up to this point as far as maybe springboard towards the future. Well, I, it was a heck of a jump. Uh, at first I was kind of nervous, not knowing, uh, I mean, not knowing what the, what the future held. I mean, it's a big step going from a four-cylinder to a late model. And uh, I mean, it turned out it turned out pretty pretty well. Not, we didn't have very much bad luck, but I mean, everyone has a has their good days and everyone has their bad days. Uh, today was a good day, and uh, we were lucky and we had a good car. Uh, the crew helped us out a lot. We had a good crew and and uh, a lot of support behind me, my family. And I don't know if you could ask for any more. Well, you say we're lucky, but I watched the race and. Uh, you made some of your fortunes. You know, you you were smart enough. You didn't put yourself in position to to have something happen, and you saw things in front of you that were happening, and you you didn't push the envelope. And I mean, that usually comes with experience. We don't expect that from a 16-year-old. You're out here. You got a big fan base here. You got something to prove. You know what I mean? But you didn't look at it that way. Yeah, that's right. Uh, my first goal was was to bring the car back without without too many scratches on the car. That way we can just put a cover on it and bring it out the next time. Uh, I mean, I, I knew that we had a pretty fast car and that if if I was in position to uh, to bring it home first, I, I was going to do it. But I mean, it, it could have been the other way around too. I could I could have been slower than than um, Mr. Morse over here, and I would have just pulled pulled in behind him. Yeah, no, that, I'll tell you, I, I don't know when the last time I think I've been at a race and been this impressed with, with such a young individual. And I know uh, the people down in the southern part of the state where I live and go to most of the races, they're really missing the opportunity to see a young talent like you. So hopefully uh, you're able to make some of the races down towards the southern part of the state, some of the bigger late model races, because I think you've got a bright future. And if you keep the same attitude you got, you can go places because you're obviously you've got – Good parenting, good people behind you, and uh, you know what it takes. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm pretty lucky right now. All right, well, congratulations. There's your winner in the Spud 150. That's Austin Terrio. Thank you. Thank you.